What's up, people? Tessaran here, and welcome back to the world of Warcraft. We're carrying on questing in the Eastern Plaguelands. Uh, so, we've got the quest to go and see Terranar Sunstrike, which is just to the south of us. Uh, but just quickly before we get cracking, where we have managed to get some uh, heavy leather, I just want to make a few armor kits because we haven't actually been using them for a while we've still got a couple on us but just sort of upgrade it a bit now these give us two armor on each of them I think we only have I think it's only the yeah it's only the legs and feet that we actually need to apply them to so we'll have two left over Chuck him on. Excellent, and that takes our leather work into 170, so never know, might be able to actually learn something else next time we're at a trainer. Scholomance. That's one we've not done yet. Yeah, we'll join the queue and uh, see if we can get into Scholomance. The one I'm waiting for is uh, the instance called Strathbone, which is my favourite dungeon out of the sort of the one to sixty instances it's definitely my favourite. Oh right, here we go. Right, fingers crossed it's not die them all. And it's die them all. Okay, fingers crossed this one we've not done. Excellent. Well at least we get uh, we get some new quests. This is quite a longish one so This one may take up the whole episode. Peace be with you. Go in peace. Good luck. Hopefully this is a group that knows uh, which order to do it in. Looking pretty good so far. No good to us now, we're on there. Uh... Don't really want mail now. Don't really want to pick up any leather.
Trouble is, once uh, you've done the, this instance, you've got to run all the way back to the end just to finish off one quest. It's uh, slight time consuming one. Easier at this point to jump down rather than run all the way around. <coughs> yeah. Did a lot of good. Wasn't expecting that. Not entirely sure which one it is. He's running back around that way. Oh, I didn't recognize that. I'd... Bloody hell. There's going to be one quest undone. Didn't recognise that they killed it, even though I did contribute in the damage. I think we've run out. Left 
time for any Dark Moon there. It ended yesterday. But I think the Dark Moon Fair is once a month, so it will just be next month when the Dark Moon Fair comes up. I'll just hand it in for your quest to do straight away. Nice, we'll have some of that though. Okay, so what we'll do is we'll teleport out. What do you mean, not over combat? It's a shame we didn't get to see how that one. That's what we got for level 42. And misdirection. Not actually something I use quite often, but usually there's no need for it because you tend to wait for the tank to initiate the uh, combat anyway. Peace be with you. Never mind. May the stars guide you. The treasure. Go in peace. I don't know whether any of those treasures are actually any good to us. <clears throat> Have a gander. Uh, 
axe, staff, trident, and a hammer. So, no, none of them are. But one, seven, eight, two, three, five. Oh, I've just missed it. Yeah, so we get the trident because that gives us the most cash. That didn't take as long as I thought. So we like we died and messed up, and that only go. I mean, we went into it straight away, didn't we? So less than 15 minutes. Baladash, Malanore. Okay, kill five death steps. Miscreations at death step in Eastern Playgrounds. Farewell. It's basically it's the middle big thing. Slept a little bit. I'm pretty sure somewhere. Oh, now we need the plug here. Sorry, play count plus. Oh, I lost Rappi. How could I have been so cruel? Yeah, I might be talking out my ass, but I thought there was a. Anyway, 
anyway, so we need plague hound blood. Now I know that these can be a pain in the ass. Get in there, get in there, get in there, get in there, get in there. This is where the beast tracker does come in useful quests like this. playing quite dumb today, sorry about that, I'm literally not looking at my own health bar. Plus I'm so used to playing with uh, looms, the prospect of dying is usually quite non-existent. Again, shall we? to use kill shot a bit more often. It's my only real source of uh, healing. Perhaps an extra six stamina will help. It's 4984 at the moment. Extra six, it did uh, gives us a little something, something to be proud of.
a small fucking like it. Although perhaps now I'm at the stage where I do prefer to do that. Perhaps now I'm at the stage where I could really do with the tanking pet. Is the only bears that I know of really. The closest ones are the ones in the Western Plague Lands, and they are plague bears. They're quite. Yeah. Looks alright if you've got an undead hunter. Oh, I've done them all. Quite a bit of leather out of it. Oh, got the slack of good. Mm, added haste. Does haste regenerate my focus? Let me have a look. It increases attack speed and focus regeneration, so it could be good for us. I'm not too bothered about the lack of health, it's the free agility. So that's 226 to 260 attack damage. Not a great difference at all. Haste does affect the attack speed. I'll, st I'll stick with the one with haste, I think. Perhaps we can get a focus to. Uh, How may I help you? Chances are it won't be that noticeable, but. Way better than what we've got. The fresh plate, right? Cheers, mate. Nice, right, we'll stick a. Pad on it. Kit rather. Put it on. The owner's caravan. So if the owner's lucky charm will give us a chance to loot extra gold. Chance to deal extra holy damage on melee and range attacks. That's pretty good. Especially since a lot of it is undead. What was the last one? More of these unlock as we get more people to join the, the van. And that's a successful spell, so that one's no good to us. I think we'll go for the moment with the cash. We'll ride to the next destination. With our faithful raptor trying to overtake us by going through the centre of the caravan. Well done mate. There is an achievement for getting every possible person to join the caravan. I think I will try and go for that. It will also help build our reputation with the Argent Crusade and the Argent Dawn. And that's what gives you the uh, title. I don't know what they're laughing at. Title of the Argent Champion, which I have already got. But we'll see if we get it.
So I do collect the titles, but I don't often put them on. Don't know why. Just it's mainly for bragging rights, and I'm not much of a bragger. Although it seems a bit of a contradiction, considering that I'm recording it and putting it on YouTube, but I, I've not done it as a look at me, look at me, look at me playthrough. I've done it more of a, a playthrough. Crown Guard Tower. Okay. That's all I've got time for you. Time to this playthrough for this episode my voice has just gone tits up anyway that's all I, that is all I've got time for for this one so thanks a lot for watching join me in the next one where we will crack on and send the coach the next way so hopefully in the next episode we'll crack on with all these quests here and finish these ones off so, see you soon.